Hey guys, these are guided timeless messages. If these messages resonate with you, give me a thumbs up, like, share, subscribe, you guys. So I'm getting a vision, okay? I'm getting a vision of a screen and it's, 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 it's saying game over and red and it's blinking. Okay, this is a video game that I'm seeing here. I'm seeing an old video game, uh, Nintendo, specifically an old Nintendo cartridge uh, console. I'm seeing the two purple things. So definitely a Nintendo. Not I, I don't know if that's resonating, okay? Um, there was a, it's, it's a thief that's trying to get some type of gift here. So obviously something is over for this thief here. Okay. This is an old thief. This is an old soul or whatever games that they was playing or whatever game that they're playing is really old, outdated, or it's just their plays is fucked up. Okay, so I'm getting, I'm, I'm just seeing a screen of it saying game over. This shit is played out, whatever this is, okay? Someone was playing a game that they lost or couldn't finish or they can't finish. Either they have, they either they don't have any more lives, plays, or ammo. It's like this person is stuck, okay? Okay, either way, they have lost, a big loss. Game over. I'm gonna now they have a choice. It's like this person has options or a choice to start over again, to repeat this cycle, or come up with another plan or a better solution, or they can leave. Either way, it's an issue that needs to be resolved with this person here. Okay. This has a lot to do with some type of worthiness or somebody's not, they don't like that they're not getting something here, okay? The problem is whoever this is, they don't see an issue with their self, okay? This is somebody who, I just did a reading about an entity, okay? So I'm getting this energy, they still focus on the game here. They're not focused on healing or realizing they don't like defeat. They don't like to lose here. The game they keep losing, okay? Somebody is still focusing on a game that they keep losing here, okay? This is somebody who likes to conquer here, okay? This person never complete cycles or they never complete a game, okay? They repeat the same cycles, level or, yeah, level of a game over and over again. They repeat some type of cycle. It's like this person is not getting some type of big picture. So they keep repeating the same type of plays. Like you play in a video game. If you keep replay, repeating the same plays that's not working for you, you're going to die or you're going to fail. Or most likely in video games, you either die or you fail a mission. Okay, so somebody failed some type of mission here and they're keep repeating the same type of plays here okay <laughs> that's just uh, strongly what i'm getting here okay they're stuck on the same level in the game the game is over okay somebody somebody need to realize some type of game is over okay somebody didn't learn a lesson so they have to repeat a lesson again okay community bottom of that great fortune here okay it's something that this person refuses to see or admit that they are doing wrong here, okay? They are not get they're not getting some type of honesty with their self or they're not being honest with their self, okay? Somebody is playing they're playing with their own life, okay? It's like they're playing with their life and they, they don't like when something and, and, and when they don't get their way, they play victim. Okay, it's strongly what I'm getting. This is like somebody who is playing with a controller, trying to play this game, and then when they lose, they throw the fucking controller at the TV. Angry. Okay. 
I'm getting can't collect $200, go to jail, okay? I'm getting this is somebody who, they hang with other people who like this. It's like they're surrounded with people who are like this, okay? It don't necessarily have to be somebody who plays a game. Literally, this could just be life in general, okay? Yeah, this is somebody who, they, they hang with people who repeat cycles too, or they hang around with people who, who is reciting their cycles as well, okay? Um, this person thinks that this is a long-term beneficial scheme that's going to work out for them. They like challenges, even if it destroys you, <laughs> destroys you, or even if it destroys them. They think that they're safe in this toxic energy, or they're comfortable in this toxic energy, or this person owes a toxic energy okay and they keep repeating some type of cycle with this toxic energy over again okay so yeah this person has a choice i'm getting this is a like a, a entity that's owing they, they're coming back to collect here okay six on the clock here this person is very conflicting Okay, this could be somebody who you don't trust or this person has trust issues here. Overall energy, you have great fortune, despair, and coffin. Yeah, somebody's getting some type of rewards here. I'm strongly getting like whoever this person is getting rewards here. This is somebody who defeated some type of demon or devil or entity here. Somebody conquered some type of devil energy here. And I feel like whoever this devil energy is in despair. Okay, something has ended. It could be spell work. It could be somebody who's just not interested in this person or somebody is, they're in despair because something has lost here. If you realize on a despair card, there are people in the background. Okay, this could be entities. These could be souls. These are people who are coming in to collect here. This person may owe loans or they owe a loan shark or they owe some type of goons or they owe police officers, okay? So it's like a police officer at, or somebody is somebody got detectives after them, okay? So take that how I resonate here. So somebody's getting some type of message of concern, okay? Maybe about this main female. Whoever this main female, this privileged lady, and this mature woman is, this could be the same person here. Somebody is getting some type of message of concern from either three people or they're getting a message of concern from one person. Whoever this person is could be a high priestess or somebody who is speaking out or their crown chakra or their third eye chakra is open. This is somebody who is a visionary or they have some type of visions here, okay, with this privileged lady. The privileged lady is a visionary. A very creative visionary. This could be somebody who is very spiritually high ranked or somebody who is very expensive. Okay. Somebody is getting some type of message of concern about this person here. It could be from a letter, maybe online. Maybe they're getting some type of messages online, but it's some type of enlightenment here. Okay. It's an eye opener here. Somebody is very disappointed about this though. This is like some type of eye opener. It's not it's like good news, but it's not good news for this person here. This could be somebody who casted some type of spell here, okay? It could be this false person here, okay? Whoever this false person here, this is somebody who's getting some type of awakening here, okay? They may be getting some type of awakening in their dream or they're getting some type of awakening at home in the distant horizons here. But somebody's getting some type of awakening here. This could be somebody... Whoever this message of concern is, it's the same person. Um, this could be a Leo, Aquarius, Pisces, Cancer, Capricorn, Sagittarius, um, Gemini, Taurus, Virgo, energy here, Libra. I probably, I think I already said Libra. No, I didn't. So... Yeah, whoever this person is, this is a false-ass person here. This is a fake-ass, phony-ass person here. This person, um, this is somebody who tried to compete with you or challenge you in some type of way here, okay? Um, 
this person refused to believe that things are the way they are, but at, they refuse to believe that something is being illuminated here. This could be somebody who drinks a lot or is an alcoholic. Whenever I see the false person image here or this car, I think about the 1920s or the 1930s or 40s. This may be like an old soul energy. This is somebody who... I think about the whorehouse in that time, okay? So somebody may have been somebody who in that time is in this energy it's like this person is from a whorehouse from the 1920s okay i'm gonna just leave that at that okay their their soul or their body or their image or their entity is from that time okay this is somebody who has came back in time okay this is um somebody who is Yeah, this is a, a repeating cycle for this person here. This person is in the same type of cycle now. They've been like this in other lifetimes. They've been in a whorehouse for a lifetimes or they've been some type of secret or they've been in this type of energy in other lifetimes, okay? And this person is having some type of awakening here. You or somebody is brought in this person's mind. They're getting some type of messages here and it's a concern for this person here. Okay, this is somebody who tried to challenge you and they misunderstood something here. They may have thought that you were easy to challenge or they thought they could challenge you. Okay, this person is feeling concerned about their ignorance here. They're feeling defeated here. They're feeling defeated about this woman, this occupation here. They're, def they're defeated by this businesswoman or this woman that's focusing on work or this woman that's very enlightened here okay they're really defeated about this person because maybe this person is married or they're in some type of relationship or this false person may be sleeping with somebody's husband here okay they're realizing that this business woman or this person in this occupation car they don't have to be a woman they're realizing that this woman is an empress to someone else here this is somebody else's wife here they're defeated by somebody's wife here okay somebody is feeling defeated because somebody is moving on another journey here okay they're going another pathway or they're going through some type of spiritual enlightenment here and it has a lot to do with probably a connection a relationship or them loving their self okay yeah, I feel like somebody is trying to steal somebody's high honor or somebody did try to steal somebody's high honor, but they're out in the cold. Somebody tried to scam somebody or somebody tried to scheme somebody. Like I said, somebody plays is over. They don't have no more lives. They don't have no more ammo to attack you here. They're out in the cold here. This is somebody who did some magic here and they're out in the cold here. This is a rat a rat okay this is somebody from the whorehouse that sounds so fucking sad but i mean look at this picture it reminds me of that that time okay so you may be getting high honor and somebody is feeling irrelevant this is probably somebody who scams to get high honor they're not getting their way okay you may actually it may be a difference here, okay? This privileged lady and this occupation, main female, mature woman may be the same person. Or this mature woman and this false person is the same person, okay? Main female, privileged lady is the same person. And mature woman and false person could be a different type of person here. Mistress, false person. Main female, privileged lady is a healing energy. And this, is a, this could possibly be a low vibrational energy here, okay? I feel like... This person tried to steal your energy here and it failed. So now this person watching you in secret here, they're discovering unexpectedly something about probably a mature man, a wealthy man here. They're in imprisonment about this person here having a new beginning here. Okay. Yeah. Okay. They're in an imprisonment that somebody is going back to their wife or having a reconciliation or forgiveness with their wife. This is somebody who either didn't know their place or they didn't know who they were in somebody else's life. Or this is somebody who didn't want to recognize that they was a false person or they were hiding or giving some type of illusion that they was some type of false person here. Okay. 
At the present time, you have community here. So somebody's getting an upgrade in the community or they're getting some type of respect in the community here. And there is somebody in the background that is really angry. It's like whoever this person is in the background, this person, it's like they can't do anything. It's like all they can do is watch and be angry. Yeah. Somebody can't collect $200 and they're going to jail. Is what I'm getting here. This could be spiritual jail here. This overall energy is great fortune here. Somebody is upset because somebody's getting some type of rewards or they're at bliss or they're getting some type of good opportunities or they're getting a, a good experience here. Okay. And somebody's in the background really jealous. Okay. This is a cycle for this person here. Okay. This person could be somebody who acts like a child here, okay? This is a repeating cycle with this hula hoop. Somebody is in a hula hoop type of energy here, okay? Nine of Swords in reverse. This person is going through maybe a mental breakdown with some type of good opportunity that you are having or some type of good opportunity that someone else is having here. Okay, okay. Okay. <laughs> Tell me about this community card here. Okay, somebody could be 39 years old, 26. Yeah, I'm strongly getting like this person can't do anything. It's like this person really has to maybe worry about their self for once or worry about their childhood issues that they have because I'm strongly getting like somebody is repeating some type of childhood anger issues or some type of childhood issues, okay? This is somebody who probably likes to challenge people that they know that they can't challenge or they just always up for a challenge but never a challenge for their self strongly what i'm getting here okay this person is is busy trying to come up with a solution to attack or trying to come up with a solution to collect in some type of way here this is somebody who is very dark and cold here I feel like if you are in a connection with somebody or you don't have to be with anybody, I just feel like you are being celebrated right now. You're very content in this great fortune energy here and it's causing people to be in despair or it's causing somebody else to be in despair here, okay? I'm seeing a, a balloon floating in the air outside. Look like a damn alien. I'm shuffling again because a, a car fell, and I don't know wh wh which which way it fell. Okay. Somebody wants to come and rush in and give you some type of message here. Okay. Tell me more about this community card. I was supposed to shuffle, obviously, because now it's coming out here. Okay. Cherry in reverse here. Okay, if somebody is trying to come towards you while you're leveling up or you're getting some type of respect in the community here, they don't have no direction to come towards you. Like I said, they don't have no more ammo or something here. This is somebody who is, they're stuck on some type of relationship or they're stuck on some type of past here. This could be a third party situation or this is somebody who wanted some type of reunion with somebody but that they're still stuck on, okay? This is somebody who is, uh, you, you can't trust this person here. This could be somebody who has a very negative, negative mindset, very closed-minded. Their emotions are very negative here. Um, this is somebody who is realizing that they can't come towards you or they can't come towards somebody else here, okay? They may be trying to force their energy onto you or they're trying to come in in this aggressive type of energy, very out of control, okay? This is an outsider, okay? They're, they're looking outside. They're looking from outside or, or inside. They're inside, but they're outside of whatever this is here, okay? They're very overbearing. This is somebody who is very insecure and they're blocked out of something here. Okay, this is a very weak energy here. My ears is burning here. The letters GPY can be very significant. Okay. Yeah, somebody is like refusing to believe that something is the way it is here. Okay. 
this is an outsider. This I'm getting the image of somebody who is looking inside. They're they're outside and they're looking inside of a window. They're looking at somebody or they're looking at a family here. Okay, four of pentacles in reverse, king of pentacles in reverse, star, world, two of cups in reverse, ace of swords in reverse, and a nine of swords. Okay. Ten of Swords and the Knight of Swords in reverse here. Somebody feel backstabbed and betrayed because of a missed opportunity with somebody. But this is probably somebody who tried to backstab and betray you or tried to bully you or tried to bring you some type of conflict in your life, tried to demean you or was very rude towards you. And they didn't give a fuck when they did this shit. This is somebody who is very critical and very cynical. And when shit happens to them, this person acts like a victim or they act like a child. They act like a child that's angry or an angry child, okay? So you got four pentacles in reverse, king of pentacles in reverse, and a star, right? After you have the world, okay? So I'm getting this energy where somebody is... Somebody is not holding on to something anymore, okay? Something is very unsuccessful or somebody needs to let go of something that's not going anywhere, okay? They need to heal, okay? Some type of cycle is being closed out with a relationship. Some type of relationship is completely imbalanced here. And it's having somebody all up in their head. Somebody is feeling more so offended that something is not working. And the reason why they're feeling offended is because somebody either is going back to their wife or they're going back to being with their self here. If this person was trying to get some type of finances, they're not getting something. They're not getting some type of finances or they're not getting some type of husband. Somebody tried to steal somebody's husband or boyfriend or somebody tried to steal somebody away from somebody. It's crazy because you're not, I don't get the, the energy. I don't, I don't respect the energy of the idea of somebody stealing somebody from somebody. You can't steal something from somebody. A person is a person. But take this how it resonates. This is the messages that I'm getting here. This person is offended and now they're in this victim mentality here. Okay? This is somebody who is trapped up in their mind. They're having fear and anxieties. This could be somebody who's, who really has some type of psychological issues here. With this Nine of Wands, this is an ongoing thing. This is an ongoing battle that this person has. This is somebody who keep repeating the same cycles over and over again. They're on the same level. And this could be somebody who is very childish. They're on the same childish type of level here. Okay? I feel like people around this person is really tired of this person. A lot of people are guarded from this person. This is somebody who is very wounded and they take it out on everybody else, even the fucking screen or game, okay? So, yeah, my ears is burning right now. This person really needs some psychological help here, okay? And that balloon in the air is very significant, okay? Somebody is like floating, okay? Eight of Pentacles, Ace of Cups in reverse, the Devil in reverse, and the Emperor in reverse here, okay? So somebody is three, three, three. This is definitely a third-party situation. Somebody is moving forward from a third-party situation or they're moving forward from a collaboration that they have that's not going anywhere, okay? They're not putting anything into the situation. They're not putting any type of effort into the situation. They're selling on. This is somebody who is withdrawing. They're making a decision to withdraw. This is somebody who is, they had two decisions, but somebody is moving forward and making a decision to move forward here, okay? They're realizing the grass is green on the other side without dealing with this person or this collaboration or this job, okay? So with this Eight of Pentacles, Ace of Cups, and this Devil in Reverse here, somebody is like, this could be somebody who is building on something or working on something here that's really unrequited, okay? Because I'm strongly getting like somebody is, somebody is leaving something behind and somebody else is like not, they're not interested. It's very imbalanced here. I feel like some somebody is working on something Working on a breakup or working on something that is broken up, okay? It's unrequited. It, somebody is blocking off their emotions. This is a breakup, okay? There is no new beginning here with this Ace of Cups in reverse here. The devil in reverse, this is definitely somebody who is completely detaching. This is a breakup. 
somebody is overcoming whatever this is, okay? And I feel like somebody is in some type of delusional world here, okay? Whoever this Emperor Marissa is, this is probably somebody who is detaching from this energy here. This could be somebody who feels like they wasted a lot of time, okay? This is somebody who is... They may have procrastinated or they're procrastinated of letting this go or they procrastinated with letting this person go or letting this situation go, okay? It's, it's kind of like out of this person's control on how somebody reacts or, it's, or I mean, whatever this is that's not going anywhere is really out of, it's out of the control. It's like, it is what it is, is what I'm getting here, Okay. Yeah, this is like definitely a third party situation that's ending here. Yeah, somebody is detaching or they're transforming here. Somebody is detaching probably from somebody who is still trying to hold on to a situation, okay? Somebody is trying to tame control of a situation here where they're really determined to have to take this leap of faith. Whoever this person is, they're really dark. They're trying. This could be somebody who's really manipulating a situation here. A very dark, reckless person here. Somebody is like over the top and really extra or this is a, a very imbalanced type of person. They don't see the big picture or they lack perspective, okay? You could be dealing with a Cancer, Capricorn, Taurus, Aquarius, Scorpio, Aries. Yes, Sagittarius, Virgo, okay, yeah, so I'm going to pull from this deck, I just feel like somebody is just, somebody didn't know their place, if they was a third party and they knew they was a third party in the first place, somebody fell in love with somebody who is unrequited, a cycle is closed out and somebody is just completely imbalanced about it. This could be somebody who is completely having a mental breakdown. They're not taking care of their self. This is somebody who completely needs to heal some type of childhood wounding here. This could be mother or father issues here. Somebody always probably tried to fight for some type of attention in a, a home situation or a dysfunctional home situation. Somebody always probably felt abandoned in their home. And this is why this healing needs to be needs to be happening here. Somebody needs to heal. Somebody oh, okay. This was about lust. Let me get this card. High priestess of spirit here. Somebody needs to get the truth or go within here. Okay. Somebody's really determined here. Somebody really needs to determine, needs to be determined to heal. Somebody's really determined to overcome some type of obstacle in a lust energy. This was based off of lust. High priestess of spirit here. This could be definitely um, a high priestess involved. It could be a cancer. A cancer or a Leo involved here. Okay. This is definitely somebody who is determined to overcome some type of obstacle in a lustful energy and a lustful connection here yeah whoever this is is being summoned here okay somebody needs to see something somebody needs to see that they're repeating some type of cycles over and over again lust summon and cycles here okay somebody needs to go through a spiritual transformation okay somebody needs to let go okay this is causing too much grief and pain Somebody is repeating a cycle. This is cycles here. This person keeps doing the same shit over and over again, okay? Yeah, this is somebody who is completely broken. Listen, keep hope alive here. I feel like somebody needs to understand that they need to heal something here. Because I feel like the reason... That it, this could have been like a middle child or this could be somebody who... Either this is a middle child or oldest child. This person didn't get enough attention at home or they're always striving to prove a point or they're always striving to win a situation, okay? This is probably somebody who always uh, fought with their siblings 
or had a rival with their siblings because maybe their parents show more attention to other people here. Yeah, it's many faces in this card here, okay? This is somebody who has many faces, okay? Somebody who could possibly be a shapeshifter here. These are many faces with different eye colors and everything. Yeah, this is definitely somebody who could be a shapeshifter and they are always in some type of lustful energy. Maybe they thought, maybe they think lust is um, going to win somebody over here. But whoever this emperor is, they're really not interested. They're, 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 this is like somebody who is, that they feel over, over, over burden or they feel like this is overbearing or this is just too fucking much, okay? Honestly, whoever this emperor is, I feel like this person probably realized they wasted a lot of time probably they may have abused their power or they strung somebody along, okay? The letters that I got in this reading is uh, GPY, um, DMV, yeah, strongly. I'm going to pull from the meditation messages here. It just seems like this this is over something is over some type of game is over and maybe somebody is realizing that they just got strung along or they may have thought a situation was going to go further than what it is here okay yeah virgo neptune could be very significant taurus moon when is the taurus moon did we miss the taurus moon we missed the Taurus moon a couple months ago, but it's probably going to come at the end of this year here, okay? Accept yourself. Accept yourself. Or somebody got Taurus moon, okay? Virgo, Neptune, okay? Something told me about Taurus. It's, it's, it didn't, it's not saying Taurus full moon, but something about Taurus moon here. It could be a new moon or a full moon, Okay? By taking good care of the present moment, we take care of the future, okay? What? I can't say this, so I'm just going to put that up there. Lifestyle change. Somebody needs a lifestyle change or they need to have a different outlook on life here. No communication here, okay? Somebody's not communicating here. Something is good timing, okay? Judge. Somebody feels judged, okay? Somebody is in some type of victim mentality here, but I'm strongly getting like this is somebody who attacks people. And then when they get called out or they attack up or the, the peak or they, yeah, or they get called out or judged, they, they start getting this victim mentality here. Good timing and bad timing, okay? Feathers. Somebody is seeing feathers. Somebody's a knucklehead, okay? <laughs> Meditation can be very significant, okay? Somebody's dealing with a knucklehead that need to meditate here, okay? Capricorn in their seventh house, okay? Taurus in their fourth house, okay? Capricorn Taurus is very significant, Virgo, okay? Earth sign can be very significant, okay? Landscape can be very significant, <laughs> be savage, not average. That's probably what this person's energy is. They want to be savage, not average, I guess. I, I don't know. Number 39 could be very significant. The letter S could be very significant here, okay? Somebody got long hair. Be quiet, okay? Number 14 could be very significant. The letter D could be very significant, okay? It could be somebody who is probably leaving a situation that's quiet. They're not communicating. They're not saying anything, okay? They don't want a collab with some situation here. A good experience. Somebody's having a good experience. This is a good, good experience. This is a good place. Something is center stage, okay? Something is 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 summit here, okay? Somebody is seeing something, something is somebody's being a witness to something here, or somebody is 
seeing something here, okay? Yeah, somebody's getting some news, questioning, okay? Somebody's in question or it's, it's, it's some type of detective going, it's, it's some type of detective energy going on here. Somebody is getting questioned or somebody is questioning a lot of things here, okay? Number 95 could be very significant. The letter V could be very significant. My right ear is ringing very low. Okay. Google could be very significant. Somebody needs to Google something or somebody's on Google here or Google could be very significant. I mean, we're on YouTube. So all love. Something is all love. The number 92 could be very significant. The letter Y could be very significant. Okay. Something is all love. Okay. I just feel like somebody needs to let go of something that's just, it just has no growth in the situation, okay? Somebody is, this definitely, this King of Swords could be a, a, a detective or a police officer or a lawyer, okay? That's trying to tame control too as well, okay? But something is not no growth. Maybe this is a case. That's that that has no growth or they have nothing on a case, okay? It's like case closed, okay? So that's what I'm strongly getting from this energy here. It's it's like this is the end of something here. Somebody needs to take good care of themselves. They're not taking care of themselves because they're not getting what they want here, okay? They're blocked and it's out of their control, okay? But I love you guys. I hope this is very helpful for you guys. Again, this is Timeless Note of Messages. If these messages resonate with you, give me a thumbs up, like, share, subscribe, you guys. Love you guys. Smooches.